Right, so now you've done the massage on the face, we're going to do something else now just to really uh, add a finishing touch to, um, to our routine, and that's with uh, facial uh, guasa, okay, which is slight scraping therapy. It's not as, um, as invasive as what it sounds. It's really just trying to get more uh, blood flow into the, into the area so we, uh, because, so we get more, um, we produce more uh, collagen and elastin into, in, our, in our skin as well, just to encourage the production of that. So it gives, uh, gives more plumpness to, to the skin and really fills in some of, the, some of the, um, the, the more smaller lines in our faces. So without further ado, I'll, uh, I'll show you how it's done. First, we'll begin with a bit of oil and just apply that liberally onto your face. So what I'm using at the moment is uh, it's coconut oil. I really like using it. Uh, I tend to use that in all, my, in all my treatments, for those of you who have ever uh, booked in a session with me. So just apply that onto your, onto your face like so. Get that onto your neck as well, because we'll be working on that area as well. I'd like to use the organic uh, variety because you can, it has a really nice Nice smell to it as well. Okay, so taking taking your your spoon. This could be a spoon, or it can be a jam jar lid, if you wish as well. Okay, so you're taking you're going to so for the forehead you're going to go across, like so. So I'm just going to trap a bit of the skin this way, and then go across. And so really, what you're trying to do is trying to encourage a little bit of redness here on the skin. But you're not trying to traumatize the skin in any way. You're not trying to bruise anything, or you're not trying to take any skin off. You're just doing it to a point where you see a little bit of redness. Like so. Just going through the forehead here. And as, and as you apply it onto the sides of the eyes, you always aim to go outwards, like so. Doing a little bit here. And working down just under the eyes. So we're gonna go out, out, out. So you can see my face starting to redden up a little bit. So it's less like trying to traumatize, but more like, more about trying to bring bring about a nice healthy glow to your to your face. So you can see the style of which I'm doing it. I'm almost I'm almost mimicking uh, shaving here. Well, it's just not all the way up here. Going across here. So your face should start to feel a little bit tingly as well. Almost like you've given your, your face a really, really good massage. And you can go across here, off your moustache. And the chin. And on the jawline, so it's good as well for the for the neckline as well. So you start to scrape upwards. Right, so. Uh, 
Okay, so this is great. So you've got you've got the massage routine, you've got the facial scraping routine, uh, the wasa routine, which will take you about ten minutes uh, out of your your morning routine. So I think this is something that uh, that we can all we can all fit in uh, to uh, to to see see about uh, good results. So try it every day for a week and see how you get on. Maybe what you should do is take a photograph um, before you start the scraping routine. Take another photograph of yourself a week later and see if you notice any changes. Or we'll try maybe to be uh, to be a bit more um, to be a bit more certain with the results. Maybe give it about a month and see how you get on. So um, give this a shot. Uh, let me know how you get on. If there's any other videos you'd like me to do, please do get in touch and I'll do my best to uh, uh, to do something for you. Until next time, take care. Stay healthy. Bye now.